Welcome back to Recap Central. Today I'm going to explain a sci-fi movie called Terraform Mars. Spoilers ahead subscribe if you like the video. Bad overpopulation caused 21 century humans to terraform Mars. Changing its atmosphere. With plants and genetically engineered cockroaches. It's the year 2597 in Tokyo. The police are chasing Komachi and Nana. They murdered someone. A government official. Dr. Honda offers them an opportunity. They have to go to Mars and exterminate the cockroaches they sent years ago. He offers them a lot of money and cleaning their criminal record. If they are successful. Komachi is suspicious of the doctor and doesn't want to signa the contract. After thinking for a while Nana accepts the deal. Komachi gets angry at her. But he says he can't let her go alone. And he accepts as well. Two years later they are arriving to Mars. On the spaceship there are many people like them. Komachi fights with his rival Jin. Nana doubts the competence of the team as they are all low-life criminals. The team probably was made like that for monetary reasons. Captain Dojima tells them to prepare for landing. The landing is successful. Everyone on the ship is surprised seeing Mars so green. A device is released that is supposed to kill the roaches. The crew is ordered to split on teams and check the progress of the extermination. A woman is paired with a Yakuza but wants though change partner. The captain agrees. A drone finds a previous sheep the government sent 10 years ago. Gojima tells Honda they will make contact with the ship. Honda is happy as he may have a different plan for the mission. Jen and Maria are checking the surroundings. They are surprised when they find no dead roaches in the area. They continue to explore and the find some primitive humanoids. They quickly hide. Komachi and Nana also find one of the creatures. Komachi salutes him. The creature attacks Nana and breaks her neck. It sprints away with superhuman speed. Jen and Maria find Komachi. Jen informs him other member of the mission have been killed. The speak to the captain. It appears he knew about the creatures but had orders to say nothing. He explains the creatures evolved really fast due to radiation. Dr. Honda appears in a hologram. He tells them he prepared injection from the insects that will grant them superpowers. Each one of them will have different powers. A woman suggests they should leave the planet due to the danger. One of the insects comes to the ship. Lee volunteers to fight it. He goes outside. A sandstorm stars. He injects the serum and starts mutating fast. He becomes an insect hybrid. Based on a ground beetle that can shoot flames. Lee fights the creature. Their power levels are similar. Lee uses his special ability. And shoots the insect with flames pushing it backwards. The crew is shocked as the creature didn't die. Only its outer shell was burnt. The insect kills Lee with one hit. At the ship a creature climbed on a window. It breaks the glass and kills two crew members. The captain injects himself and starts mutating. His mutation is based on bullet ants. Making him much stronger. Gojima easily kills the creature. Before they can celebrate the radar detects hundreds of insects. Coming towards the ship. They must leave Mars to survive. They attempt to start the engines but the engines don't work. It's like someone sabotaged them. The captain decides to distract the bugs while they go to the old ship. To find parts to repair the engine. Ichiro volunteers to stay and help the captain. Komachi sees Nana's body before leaving. He promises to return. He notices a strange string coming out of her mouth. The crew goes into the rover. Tezuka injects the serum. He transforms into a beetle that can shoot projectiles. He propels the rover by shooting flames from his moth. Ichiro and the captain fight the insects. Ichiro runs to expel all the oxygen from the ship attempting to kill all the insects. The bugs begin to fall to the floor. Ichiro faints as well. At the rover the crew sees a big wave coming. It's made of bugs. And they have to fly through it. They make it thanks to Tezuka. They continue on their way but see a second tsunami. Bigger than the first one. Osaku and Maria transform and go outside to protect the ship. They try their best but the vehicle ends up flipping over. The rover goes into autopilot and drives of. 
The girls left behind fight the insects but get defeated. The team wakes up at the old ship. Komachi looks for the girls but can't find them. They head inside the ship. Mina runs a diagnostic on the ship and learns the ship has been sending data back to Earth. They hear shoots outside. They go check the noise and find two dead crew members. The bugs learned how to use tools and killed them with their own guns. Komachi injects himself. He turns into a hornet. He is very powerful and easily kills the insects. Jen mutates into a locust. And he kills some roaches with his kicks. Mina become a mantis. And slashes some of the insects. They easily win the fight. Dr. Honda speaks to one of the bugs. The bug goes to the ship and turns the oxygen back on. It points a gun at the captain. All of a sudden the bug splits in two. Azuka comes from inside. She is based on a emerald wasp. And she can control the roach's body. Earlier she used her powers to make the bugs fight each other. She dries her hair and shoots the captain. She wakes up Ichigo. His mutation can survive extreme conditions. But requires water to reactivate. Azuka and Ichigo are on a secret mission by Dr. Honda. Ichigo was the one to sabotage the ship. They have orders to bring cockroach eggs back to Earth. Komachi's team. Hear the ship taking off. The doctor explains to them he never planned on exterminating the bugs. He wants the roach's DNA to make mutant soldiers for the government. Which would make the country become very powerful. Their mission was for research purposes and their fights have been recorded for data. It turns out the injections are made from a roach the first mission recovered. Ichigo and Azuka are taking off. Suddenly the egg hatches. Two evolved insects. Azuka tries to control them but they evolved immunity. And they kill her. The ship flies towards Earth. The two bugs call for help. The rest of the insects start flying to the ship. They swarm the ship and it malfunctions crushing back down. The insects surround Komachi's team and attack them. They transform and fight the bugs. They easily kill the normal bugs. But the two evolved insect they are much more powerful. Mina attacks one. The bug rips her arm and kills her. Enraged Jin injects a second dose of the serum. He mutates even more becoming much stronger. Komachi does the same thing. They continue fighting and killing their enemies. Jin jumps and injects one more time. The injection gives him wings. The roaches start flying but can't match his power. As they fight the team becomes tired. Jin injects multiple doses. Making his transformation permanent but also making him stronger. He kicks the leader bug with a kick. He falls down from exhaustion. Komachi defends him but the leader injures him. As the roach is about to kill them. He stops. A glowing moth comes flying towards them. It's Nana that has evolved. She flies dropping dust. Komachi tries to save Nana but Jin informs him she's been dead for a while now. A roach shoots Nana. Making the powder explode. Jin jumps and saves Komachi. Komachi cries seeing Nana burn. When Komachi wakes up he sees Jin has transformed into a locust looking creature. Jin tells him to live for the both of them before dying. Komachi finds the evolved roach. He punches it but decides to save his life. He goes into the ship and finds Ichigo. Ichigo aims at him. But save Komachi by shooting an insect behind him. They agree to cooperate until they return to Earth. They take off in the escape pod. The bugs prepare to fly but the leader stops them. Remembering Komachi spared him. Honda discovers Ichigo hacked the system and has been broadcasting everything. Honda wants to hide as he will be killed if the government finds out. His assistant is a spy and shoots him. But he already knew and kills her with poison. Ichigo swears to get revenge on the people responsible for the experiment. Komachi has a feeling they will return soon to the planet.